Hello guys, in this video I want to do a tutorial on how to remove the Docomo SoftBank or AU Bloodway that are pre-installed in Sony Xperia phone that came from Japan. But please take note that I re record this video using one hand, so forgive me if there's a lot of shake. Yes, we need to uh, enable the developer option from the setting. You can do it by um, tapping the build number several times until the developer option is enabled. Then you can go back and go to developer option, turn it on, and turn the USB debugging on. Next, you will need to download the driver for your phone so the PC can detect it. For example, if you use XZ1, you will need to select this. Or if you use the X Compact, you will need to select this. Then, next, you will need to download the ADB. Just download, just select the Windows if you use Windows, but there's uh, an option for Mac and Linux also. After you have downloaded the driver file, you can extract it to wherever you want. For example, I extract it to the desktop. Then go to the start button, right click, and select device manager. Then go to, then select your PC, whatever your PC name is, and select action, add legacy hardware. Next, select Advanced, Next, Next, and click Have This, and then browse to the extracted driver file, and select the .inf file. But I don't need to do this because I already installed it. After you have installed the driver, just extract the ADB file that we have downloaded earlier. We can work with this later on. Then connect the USB cable to the phone and select charge this device only. Go back to your PC. Open command prompt, type cd write slash, and go back to the extracted ATB file. Then copy the location of it. Go back to cmd, type cd, paste the location, but delete this initial slot uh, I don't know what to call it just enter and if you want to know if it is connected to your phone just type adb shell go back to your phone this will prompt out and just um, click ok enter ADB shell again and you can see it is recognized by the PC oh yeah I forgot to mention that it is optional to download these apps these app, apps basically do um, provide you the package name of the apps for example um, let's Select this compass, sorry, compass, and the package name is apps.r.compass. Then for uninstall, just go back to CMD, type the line pm uninstall, okay double dash user 0 and type the package name apps are compass 
apps are compass okay it shows success then you can see if I go back and select the compass again it is to say the package not found tapi apps dokum ini ada banyak kan jadi macam menyusahkan lah kalau ya mau type satu-satu so sebab tu saya akan sediakan list app package yang kamu boleh uninstall pada phone dokomo so just check it out